Lord Damian is so adorable, always carrying his plush around with him. Even when he goes to bed every day, he also happily told me that it was a birthday present from Madame. Oh my, don't you know? Huh? That was the butler speak. Oh. Lord and Madame are not a friend. They must have taken pity on him. Apparently, they're saying that the gift was Madame speak. Oh. It's not that I like blushes. It's just that I've been given everything I wanted. It's just... I thought it was the first time that my mother, who has always shown no interest in me, picked out a blush for my birthday present. So I was give it with me. <laughs> I should have known that neither my father nor my mother would have any interest in me. I have this story. If I am not the best, the Desmonds don't need me. No one will ever look at me. Compliment me or acknowledge me. I have to be the number one. More. More. I have to make more effort. I felt lonely. And it was painful. I don't care who it is. I wish someday there would be someone who would properly recognize me. I couldn't help but wish for that. What's with that girl? Ah, uh, this guy. What? Recently, I've started getting tired. I do not study as much as I did in nursery. Why is it then? Lord Amyan! Scion! I don't mind this tiredness. Becky, see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Uh, what? Zion, uh, Molly. Everyone. Me too. See you tomorrow. Uh, what are you up to? Ah, uh, shut up. Don't talk to me so casually. Unlike you, he's busy. I didn't know what kind of expression she had on her face. The next day, she disappeared from school. My pride got in the way and we couldn't see. Say you tomorrow to her. And I regret that very much. Sorry, I didn't notice. I'm sorry for the terrible thing I said. The truth, is, the truth is, the truth is, I wanted to be friends with you too. And then, Anya Forger has been missing for around a month. We suddenly get cold at the sewer. What could it be? Hold on, my intuition. Did you call for me, father? It seems you already knew her. Yes, we've met at Aiden's school. I see. So there was a child subject that managed to escape from the laboratory. We finally managed to capture that subject. This girl is in the fog. In spirit that is able to read people's minds. <laughs> After all, people will never be able to understand each other. But as long as we use this girl, we'll be able to know people's thoughts. That's the job I thought about giving her, but whatever I do, she just won't listen to me. That's why I want you to discipline her for the time being. You can do it, right? Of course you can count on me, father. I will do my best to not disappoint you. Don't worry. Everything will be alright. Let's go. But 
I will make sure to bring you back to your family. <laughs> Domian, although you're a this one, it seems you've been in good terms with members of the Apesant recently. Yes, I'm learning this as a young member of the Apesant. Well, while you're at it, why not use her to investigate what's on their minds? Uh, so he's telling me to become a spy for him. That's... That girl has a valuable talent. If she fails to do the job, then you're the one that will be responsible. If I find that she got away, then you should pay with your own life. <sighs> so that's how it is. I'm just another one to get this girl to do the job. As I thought. To father him just never. I will never let anyone harm Damian. Then make sure you don't shame the dismal name. <sighs> Jeez. Aren't you defiant? told me that everything will be all right. I don't feel scared anymore. <laughs> Stop making that face. Uh. Hey, I was looking for you. Experiment number seven. Let's go home together. Go home? Experiment number seven? Don't be stupid. <laughs> She's Anya Forger. Anya is my lover. Why did you be quiet for a second? Yes, Damian's Bella. She got her handcuffs removed. For the time being, you can stay at live in my house. Okay. This is my room. Ah. Little cyan boy, your room is messy. Uh, it can't be helped, okay? I was searching for you. Um, I also need to do my... <laughs> This whole month, I haven't gotten any sleep. After getting back here with her, I felt kind of... Damian, thank you. For not thinking that I'm creepy. <laughs>